Hey guys, I'm back with another uh, juice reveal. Um, do this might be more of a rant, <laughs> to be honest. Um, I want to get a certificate for an inhaler, um, so I picked up a couple things from them. Um, I know they've been around for a while, but I've never tried them out because they don't have a lot of options. And they, I don't know, like what they did have didn't didn't really appeal to me, so I kind of you know <laughs> walked on past. Um, but I was given the opportunity, so I figured I'd try some stuff out from them. Um, now the first thing I got a few samplers from them. Um, and one of them that I was kind of interested in trying was their coconut cappuccino. Um, unfortunately, <laughs> this could be really bad. When I opened it, um, it smelled like uh, Raid. Yeah, the bug spray. Um, and I didn't really want to try and vape that. Like That put me off. Like, that raised a big red flag to me. Um, and, like, I only had the bottle open for, like, a minute or so. And it's the smell just filled the room. And it was, like, it just lingered for, like, an hour. And I was like, yeah, okay. So I threw it away. Um, but when I'm talking to day about specifically is something I've been wanting to try for a long time. I just haven't had the opportunity because it's kind of expensive. Um, it's about $27, $28 for 30 mil and that seems like a bit crazy to me so I never got around to it but this opportunity gave me the chance to try it and what I'm talking about is the five ponds. Um, now first off, their packaging of their bottles is so cool. Like, I mean, it's a cardboard <laughs> container. It's really awesome. Um, now I picked up Lucina, which was actually my second choice. Um, because like, on Inhaler's website, like, most of them were listed as available, um, but when I put in my order, um, for my first choice, they told me that they didn't have it, and so I went back to the site, and it said it was unavailable then, but my second choice was available. And so I was like, basically like, well, can I have this instead? Or is it unavailable too? Like, <laughs> really, you guys need to keep on your website. Keep on it. Um, like another one, the samplers that I tried to order um, was out of stock. And apparently this one was out of stock. Um, so I basically had to fight to get this. And... I don't know. Like, I'm kind of disappointed. Um, nothing personal with Vipons. It's just... Well, I'll show you. You see that? The date? 2-01-14. That's kind of old. Like, so apparently, I mean... This juice that they didn't have, that's just been sitting around, um, like they sent it to me. It's like, is this, I don't know, <laughs> like, is this a joke? Is this like some kind of punishment for getting uppity with them? Um, I don't know, but whatever. You also see, um, it's lot zero zero two. Like the second 
like, <laughs> batch that they ever made. I mean, look, on the bottle, bottle number 009 out of 250. It's like, what the hell? <laughs> also, it's, um, the lowest nick they had available for the five pawns in this flavor is 18 milligrams. And if you guys seen some of my other reviews and stuff, you know that's way too high for me. But I really wanted to try five pawns out. And I was like, well, okay, I'll, you know, I'll, I'll mix it down, you know, whatever. That's cool. Um, so I wasn't worried about that. I didn't know that this was so old. This is like a piece of history right here. <laughs> Batch number two right here. It's like, wow. But I'm... I, I want I want to vape it. I want to see what all the uh, hype is about. Uh, so I've already down mixed some of it, um, as you can see. Um, That's a really dark color, by the way. It's kind of scary, just a little bit, just a little bit. Um, but okay, let's see first. The characteristics, the flavor profile. It's spiced rum mixed with a juicy white peach, creating the flavor harmony of a fruit cobbler with savory reduction sauce garnished by freshly shaved hazelnuts. That sounds like a pretty interesting juice to me. If, I don't know if you guys agree or not, but. Um, I am getting a fruit of some kind. Um, I'm assuming it's the white peach. I don't think I've had white peach before. I've had regular peach. Um, and I use juicy peach in a lot of my DIYs. Um, so I'm assuming that's what that is. Um, and there's definitely like a darker, like spicy underlying flavor, which I guess could be seen as spiced rum. Um, I don't know. Like, there's definitely not hazelnut. I'm not getting any hazelnut at all. Uh, maybe because of the bottle. Maybe because I keep saying the bottle. The juice is so, um, uh, like old and it's had a lot of time to steep. Maybe the flavors are kind of like, um, diminished. Um, because, I don't know, I'm not really picking out anything specific, um, that says, hey, yes, that is that flavor, and I'm missing one of the flavors, like, all together, it's like, I don't, I'm gonna try something a little, uh, dangerous here. <laughs> um, going to vape the unmixed 18 milligram to see maybe if, because I downmixed it to 3 milligram, maybe if that has something to do with it. Uh, I hope I don't die. <laughs> Scared of you. I don't know. It smells kind of corn chippy. <laughs> like, as weird as that is, it smells kind of like corn chips. 
Um, not that I have anything against corn chips. I have a big bag of guacamole tortilla chips that I've been eating the heck out of because they're delicious, but I don't know. It's weird to like spice rum and peach and hazelnut. This should smell amazing, but it smells like corn chips. Maybe my smell's a little off. Maybe just a little bit. Nope. <coughs> I'm trying to vape it like I normally do. Nope. Oh. That's bad. It's just, I don't know. It's amazing now that, like, I used to vape this on a regular basis. And now I'm like, eh, dying. Sorry, that was probably a really weird noise. Yeah, so, um, I am getting a little bit more flavor, but it's still so diminished. Like, there's not any discernible, discernible, there's not any specific flavor there. And I'm, uh, I'm just so disappointed. It's not Vipon's fault at all. Like in the slightest, I'm sure this juice is amazing. As uh, as amazing as like I've been hearing, but this bottle is not. It is poop, <laughs> and <laughs> you could put your money on that because that's what it is. And if you don't believe me, I will send this to you <laughs> um, if you pay for shipping and handling. Cause I am broke, <laughs> but I will say in both of these the mix, <laughs> the mix version, because there there's nothing there, and it makes me really sad. But that just means I will have to save up and get a fresh bottle somewhere other than inhaler and give it a proper review because. I believe that it deserves more than what I'm giving it, um, but it is what it is. I had this and that's what I'm working with, so this is what you get, and maybe next time will be better. I think so, but since Disappointed. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and <laughs> get out here before I start ranting again. Um, well, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.